So today in the boot camp, we are gonna open up a little bit of my mail. So this week, I got a couple of interesting packages in the mail. One of them here came from a company in New Zealand called Walk On, and we'll get to that. The other one here, is from Timberland Pro. Now, this box is a little funny because my FedEx guy, who actually knows me pretty well, didn't know if he should leave it here or not. So he called me. Uh, it, it's awesome when your FedEx guy has your personal phone number. So he calls me up and says, Hey Isaac, I got a box that's for the boot guy. That is you, right? We're going to open up this box from Timberland Pro and this package from Walk On. All right, let's get to it. So it's always a coin toss on where to start when I'm opening my mail. And I think I'm gonna start here with the walk-on. Now, this isn't my first package to get from overseas. The first stuff that anybody sent me from overseas for review were all those Chinese-made insoles, which I never reviewed because I couldn't find any English information about the materials or anything like that. So it's kind of hard for me to just to talk about something if I don't have any breakdown on exactly what it is. But this company, Walk On, the owner contacted me of it since he saw that I was doing boot reviews and he makes a product that works with blisters. So I got these three packages now of Walk On. I got a beautiful handwritten note from the guys at the company. Got a couple business cards. So I'll take some photos of this and I will put this up so you guys can see exactly what's on this business card. And now let's open up one of these things and let's look at it. Merino wool blister protection. It's 100% natural, it's recyclable, ethically farmed, biodegradable by 100%, and breathable, made in New Zealand. And this is eight grams of the stuff. So basically, when you have a blister from either walking or hiking or working or new shoes, new gloves, cycling, whatever you're doing that's causing friction inside your shoes, your gloves, wherever, Supposedly, instead of putting a band-aid on, you put this stuff on. I guess I'm going to have to wait to break in a pair of shoes that don't fit me correctly, but unfortunately, I always have shoes that fit me correctly because I try on all my shoes and I make sure they fit. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to test and review this stuff. Um, if you guys have got any suggestions or anything like that, please uh, shoot me over an email. We'll do that. But So that's walk-on. That's what the... That's what it's all about. It's about natural blister protection. So let's push this aside and let's get this in Timberland Pro clothing. All right, so I got my box here from Timberland Pro. They sent me three items. Judging by the outside packing list, it's going to be a pair of pants and two things that are a size large. We know they're going to be shirts because I don't believe that they make underwear. And if they did make underwear and the guys at Timberland Pro Clothing were sending me underwear, that would be a problem. This is a base plate shirt. I've read about these. These are pretty damn nice. They got a SPF 30 sun protection. They wick and supposedly anti-odor. This is the Wicking Good t-shirt. Alright, so let's pull this. Let's pull this out of the plastic. And yes. So this is the original fit. This is the new Gridflex canvas pants from Timberland Pro. I've been waiting to see these pants in person for a while. I knew they were coming out. It's pretty damn nice. Let's see what the fiber content is on these. The thing about all these new pants is that they're not 100% cotton anymore, so there's always going to be polyester mixed in. So we have 96 cotton and 2% Elastia, whatever Elastia is, it what allows these pants to stretch like this. And that is a good thing. That means that these things are gonna be able to flex with you. I guess it just holds true to the whole name, grid flex. Pretty damn good with the belt loops there. So you got a belt loop in the back, two over the kidneys, two on the hips, two on the front, reinforced pocket, double knee with a clean out, articulated knee is articulated in the back it's patched in the back so that means it's gonna move it's not gonna bite you 
They got a gusseted crotch, reinforced lips on the pocket of the pants. The pants them, the pockets themselves are not lined. It's just the same material made into a pocket. Nicely put on. Metal grommets on the edges of the pants. Some of you guys who work around cars in the auto industry are going to want to avoid any sort of metal so you don't scratch the paint on the cars. But everybody else, these pants are going to be hopefully awesome. A nice high-vis summer shirt from them. And this doesn't look half bad either. So the armpit section, look at that. It's a mesh section. So light can pass right through there. I'm going to bring this up to the camera. This is going to be kind of disturbing. But look at that. It's a mesh section. So right in the armpits, everywhere you need it. Nice and cool. It is really cool. It's a polyester shirt. I imagine it's 100% polyester. Let me find fiber content on this. SPF 50 on this thing. So these would be perfect in long sleeve for summer. Something with SPF 50 in it. So you guys can keep that sun off you, keep it off your neck, keep it off your arms. You know, when you don't get any reprise from being out in the sun, having something with a high SPF content is awesome. Material content, 100% polyester. So welders, you're going to stay away from this stuff. Guys grinding, stay away from that stuff. And this is a basic base plate blended t-shirt. It doesn't look like a bad t-shirt. The arm looks to be... A little bit shorter than what we're used to seeing in work clothes. I mean, that looks to be, uh, hold on. This is why I love this multi-tool so much because there's this tape measure in here that helps me out all the time. So you got a six inch arm in the armpit, which is a nice short arm. So it's not hanging down. It won't come down to your elbow. It'll stop like mid bicep for you. So it's a nice short arm. The pocket is completely reinforced at the top of the pocket, which is nice. Usually they don't do that in pockets on t-shirts. They just sew them right to the surface. And eventually when you put your phone in there or you throw something up in there, your tools or whatnot, eventually you break the pocket off. But that's a nice reinforced pocket on that t-shirt. Fiber content, we are looking at 65 cotton, 35 polyester. Since they are coating these new t-shirts of theirs with that antimicrobial coating, which they're not listing what type they're using, but I will find out when we do the full review on these, what the uh, chemical they are treating this with, just in case somebody out there has got some sort of allergy to those types of chemicals or whatnot. At least you'll know beforehand before you run out there and buy them. But stuff looks good. Can't wait to test it out. Can't wait to do a full review on these pants. Wash and dry them. Wear them for a bit. That's going to be a lot of fun. Alright, so that was my mail. As you can see, I got this wonderful package from Walk On from New Zealand. They're 100% natural blister protection for hikers, outdoors enthusiasts, new working guys who are breaking in new boots, who are getting blisters and need something to you know, stop the blisters from happening or at least just prevent them from happening, walk on. I'm gonna figure out a way to test this product. You guys email me if you got any ideas on how I can test this. Like I said, my boots usually fit perfect when I'm breaking them in. I haven't had a blister in like 18 years from a pair of boots. So if you guys got any ideas, please send it along. Walk on. Wonderful shirts from Timberland Pro. This high vis shirt, great stuff. 100% polyester, can't wait to try it out. Can't wait for it to get warm in Chicago so I can actually try this thing out and see how it works. And just see if this antimicrobial zero odor material actually works. I'm a little skeptical, but we'll see. And wonderful, 6535 cotton poly t-shirt from Timberland Pro. Another great item, can't wait to test it out and see if the anti-order in this works. And also, can't wait to see how it washes and dries to see if it shrinks a lot. Hey, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button below. It really helps out. And if you're interested, remember, you can always follow me on Instagram and Twitter. If you've got any questions about Timberland Pro clothing or about walk-on 100% natural blister protection, remember, you can always shoot me over an email. All right. Until the next time, I'm the Boot Guy. Thanks a lot for watching.